Good morrow, my lovely little ghosts, and welcome to the Dark Orchard. I'm Laura, and this is an Unus Honest video. As I said in my intro, this is an Unus Honest video. More specifically, today I'm going to be doing an Unus Honest inspired makeup. Now, if you're seeing this in the future, if you're seeing this past February 13th, you may not know what Unus Honest is. Hopefully, you do. Hopefully, you've been able to enjoy them. But if you have not, let me explain. Unus Onus is, slash was, a YouTube channel created by Ethan Nestor and Mark Fishbach, also known as Crank Gameplays and Markiplier. The two came together to create a year's worth of YouTube content. Many ideas on totally different spectrums, some out of nowhere, some corresponded with each other, but all in all, they all were fun ideas. It's been almost a year. By the time you're seeing this video, there's not much time left. And when the time runs out, their channel will be deleted. The Unus Honest channel will be no more. At the time of you watching this video, you still have some time. You may want to browse, check out some fun videos, because there are some really fun ones. My favorite personally was the Neti Pot, where they just tried out a neti pot, but they've done things from eating fire to learning survival tips, all while enjoying themselves. And it's been a wild ride. It's been absolutely awesome watching this entire channel. Their videos are strange, entertaining, and just all around fun. So if by chance you got to this video when it premiered, go to their channel. Check out Una's Honest. The links will be down in the description and at the end of this video. And today, I pay tribute to Una's Honest by doing an Una's Honest inspired makeup look. So without further delay, let's get started. Because Una's Honest does have the black and white color scheme, I'm going to be doing a black and white themed makeup. They also incorporate a spiral. So I will be incorporating a spiral into my makeup. I do not have a white water-based face paint. Do not have one. But I do have Bone Tone by Made You Look. I think I'm going to do a base coat of Bone Tone and see if it's too close to my natural skin tone. If it is, I have an alternative. So we're going to waste some time here and I'm going to try to do Bone Tone over top of my skin, see if it gives me a pale appearance, and we'll go from there. So, first step, Bone Tone by Made You Look on the face. I have two cups because I'm going to be using black and white, hopefully. So, cup for water. Sunglasses falling in the floor. They match the theme though. I think I'm going to use this medium brush. I usually use this for highlight, but. I think I'm going to use it for the paint because it's, I'm using a white paint so I shouldn't dye it necessarily, but if it does, that's okay. And I thought Bone Tone was appropriate because even though it's not like a stark white, it's Bone Tone. And Unis Honest is all about embracing the time you have left before you die. Death, skull, bone. Bone tone. It makes sense in my head. Ooh, that's gonna work. That's gonna work real good. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna cover my whole face in this. I am very much going to have to undo the bow tie and the top button so I can get that exposed part of my neck. I once again feel like Edward Scissorhands. Oh no, my necklace! My necklace! No! No! Technical difficulties! Technical difficulties! Ugh. I put my necklace on over the dress and now I'm having an issue. Uh, okay. 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 Whew. Now, take the necklace off. And it says, in Omnia Paratus, which appropriately 
in Latin means ready for anything. And I say appropriately because the name Unus Annus is also Latin, and it means one year, because the channel had one year. Okay, letting it dry. Alrighty, it's dry, and I think I'm going to do just like a light second coat, just because some areas look more skin toned than others, and I know it's going to have more of a skin tone than like her white would, but I don't have her white, so we're just going to go with what we've got and try to make it work. As is a theme in Unis Onis. So I'm still on theme and we're gonna try to make it work. Oh it looks so bright when it's wet. <laughs> So some things that are happening, series finale of Supernatural, season finale of America, Unis Honest is leaving us. What else is happening? I'm so very upset seeing Supernatural ending. I cannot express how sad I am. 15 years and it's coming to an end. And I know, I know, I know. They had a good run. That's what everybody keeps telling me. They had a good run. But I'm still not okay. Just not. Alrighty, my face is sufficiently more pale than it was to start with. So, that's good. Um, ooh. Much more pale. Look at that. Look at that difference. I have a tan. <laughs> I think I tanned doing the aerial beach thing. <laughs> anyway, let's button back up. And I hope I remember to do my hands before taking pictures. I probably won't, though. I probably won't. I'm telling you right now, probably will not. But we gonna try to remember. Don't make fun the way I tie things. So... I've taken so much time drying that I forgot what I was doing. So let me look at the picture I drew of the makeup and then I'll get back to you. So I'm going to go a little simple with this and I'm going to do a spiral coming off of this eye down onto the cheek. So to do that, I'm going to be using Ink by Made You Look. I swear one day I want her entire collection because I love these. And to do a spiral, I think I'm just going to use a narrow angled brush. And I can't fluff this up, so let's hope I get it right the first time. Here we go! So far so good, so far so good. Doing good, doing good, doing good. Alrighty. It's not thick. I think I want it a little bit thicker, so when I go over it with a second coat, I'm gonna make it thicker and possibly use the side of my brush just to give it that Unis Honest feel instead of like jigsaw. So if you have seen Unis Honest and you're a fan, did you? Not did you. What piece of merch did you like the most? I think most people would say the Camp Unis Honest shirts. Those were the coolest in my opinion. Because, I guess because they gave a, like, Camp Crystal Lake vibe. And of the classic horrors, Friday the 13th is my favorite. There. That's much better as far as the thickness of the spiral goes. So this may be a huge mistake. But I'm going to abandon the water-based paints and go to powders. I desperately want to contour, but so I found a dark gray. Okay, yeah, I'm going to use this brush that I totally didn't just wipe off on my hand. I'm going to use a gray to contour my nose at least. There. You may not be able to see it, but I feel better. I think I'm going to go back into the paint and do my eyebrows with it. I 
I feel like it's lip time, but it's not. I need to continue with the face. Eyes next. I'm going to do eyes next. I'm going to use powders, and I'm going to use the black from the Palais Royale palette because it's my new favorite black. So I'm just going to smoke out the eye that I already have. I have a base coat of black, but I covered some of it with the white, so I'm just going to go back over it. On this eye, I'm drawing out the eye a little more. And of course, I'm getting underneath the eye to fill in that skin tone. Powder done. Now I'm going to go back over my eyes and line them. So I have base. I have brows. I have eyes. My nose is missing, but it's there, see? Nose. Um, it's lip time. I love lip time. Let me just gently remove the lip I already have. Good. And now, do we know if water activated paints are lip safe? Will it hurt me? Potentially. Am I going to do it anyway? Potentially. Because I still have not located my black lipstick. And the closest that I have is Death to Unicorns from Wet n Wild. And though Death to Unicorns is a gorgeous color, it's not black. So I think I'm going to take a sip of water, hydrate, and then use a water-based paint on my lips. Will it kill me? Most likely not. But it is an Unisonis video, so if it does, upload it anyway. <laughs> I'm going to see how this works. It's pretty decent coverage. Don't do this, by the way. Insert Una's Honest Don't Try This at Home song. I am only going to be wearing this for the duration of my video. I'm not going to be licking my lips. I'm not going to be drinking anything. I just hydrated because I knew I was doing this. Do not do this. Unless, of course, it is mouth safe, in which case it's okay. But I don't know if it is or not, so I'm not telling you. Ooh, <laughs> I like that. Okay. I love it. Little clowny, but that's okay. I like it. Alrighty, this is my completed Unis Honest inspired makeup look. This is the first in a series that I'm going to be doing, hopefully monthly. I'm going to say monthly maybe bi-monthly, but monthly right now, of YouTube-inspired makeup looks. The next one that I'm going to do is going to be Mr. Beast-inspired, so definitely check that out once it comes out. I don't know the date yet, though, so I'm not sure if it'll be next month or the month after that. Maybe monthly, maybe bi-monthly. It all depends on what all happens in the music industry between now and then. Because if we get new music, because Black Veil Brides is coming out with a new song on the 13th, um, I may have to do music-related content again, which I know all of you would hate for me to have to do. But <laughs> if I have to do music-related content, which I would love, I may have to push the makeup look back a little bit, but it will come soon. And... I think I'll enjoy that one just as much as I enjoyed this one. I don't know if I can beat this one though because I really like this one. It's very clownish but in a very spooky way. I love it. It's very Unis Honest in my opinion. My good friend Broken Halo Cosplay has written a eulogy for Unis Honest and I'm going to recite that eulogy for you now. We are gathered here today in loving memory 
of our dearly departed Unis Annis. Just as suddenly as they have entered our lives, they have departed, leaving behind only their memory and their message. Unis Annis desired only to show us how truly short our time really is. And as for us, we don't know when our time will run out. They encouraged us to live our lives to the fullest, just as they had. And while we never know what life has in store for us, we must make do and appreciate what we do have. Unis Annis had so many plans, so many ideas, so many different paths to choose from. However, life had other plans. Life gave them their limits, and despite that, they never faltered on living to the fullest. So, in honor of their memory, let us not mourn their loss, but instead, let us continue to push onward, living our lives to the fullest, with their message in our hearts. Unis Annis may have left this life before us, but our clock is ticking onward, and we must take advantage of that. One day, just like Unis Annis, we will vanish as suddenly as we arrived. Until then, memento mori, in omnia paratus, and rest easy, Unis Annis. Wasn't that good? She's such a good writer. I may have paraphrased a little bit in some places because, you know, trying to memorize it and all that, but I'm pretty sure I got most of it down pat, and she's just so good. Go follow Broken Halo Cosplay because she's awesome. She also has a YouTube channel where she's done, like, day in my life kind of stuff, and she's just really cute, so go check out her channel. I might pop it at the end of this video as well because that was awesome. She's awesome. She's my baby, so go follow. So if you have seen an Unis Honest video for the comments down below, tell me which one was your favorite. Like I said before, mine was the neti pot, but I also loved like the, the learning videos. I really enjoyed the fire eating and, and the ribbon dancing and just all of those things where they were learning a task. But I also enjoyed the stupid videos where they were cooking or mixing things that shouldn't be mixed or trying to create foods out of things that aren't foods or try to create desserts out of things that aren't supposed to be desserts and I don't know I just really enjoyed all of their videos it's sad to see them go it's sad to see the channel go because I've just had so much fun it's been so enjoyable so if you have seen them please tell me down in the comments below what your favorite video was if you haven't seen any just talk to me down in the comments. You know I love for you to talk to me down in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you come around again soon. Say bye. Bye. Unis Artists.